Hello, my game enthusiasts and my PC enthusi enthusiasts. This is a Spanish dude here. Okay, I got two laptops for you. I have the Y50 and the MSI. I'm going to explain more about the MSI. I just picked up this puppy. So let's turn them on and we'll go from there. One, two, three. Now we get some timing in there and people can have an argument in the comments below which one is faster, which one they they thought was going to load faster and whatnot. So let's go ahead and do this. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and talk a little bit about the two. So, I just picked up the MSI. This is the uh, GP70. Just zoom in there for you guys to take a quick look. Okay. This one comes with a terabyte hard drive, 8 gigs of RAM, uh, i7. I'll show you guys which one it is in a moment. It has two USBs right here, 3.0, HDMI, audio. It's just logging on now. Uh, another USB here and VGA and Ethernet. Also has CD, DVD, writer right here. Okay. The keyboard is not backlit. It is a Steel Series keyboard. I would have to say it's very nice. I like the design. We have the trackpad here. Okay. I think it's uh, very nicely designed. I'm not a big fan of these little bubble things here. I don't know if you can see them. It's pretty difficult. Um, right here we got our button. You know, our left click, our right click. Me personally, I like the button more. I don't know. I guess it's a sense of control. <laughs> Um, and then we got a few options here, as you can see. So that's nice. They separate all the buttons. You got your eject button, your monitor button. You got your, like, settings here for the, uh, which is made by MSI. So it's really nice here. Um, and then you also have a couple of extra features with, you know, you got your volume, your display brightness. It's full keyboard, so that's nice. We go over to the MSI. We just have our basics, so we have our power button here. We do have, you know, the same thing as that one. Full keyboard, you got your volume button, your brightness buttons. Now, biggest difference, unlike the MSI, the Lenovo does not have a CD, DVD writer, or Blu-ray, or any of that. You have to buy a separate one, okay? MSI has a nice speaker system. It is clear, I do enjoy it. It's definitely, louder than the Lenovo but I feel the Lenovo's JBLs are more clear okay when it comes to picking a laptop there's lots of things you have to look at it's not just the brand you want to be sure that that's what you need you want to be sure that you're getting quality and whatnot when I picked up this MSI I paid $900 plus tax at Canada computer it was on sale so I paid uh, about a thousand and some odd dollars when I picked up the Lenovo, paid nine hundred. I also paid with after tax, one thousand some odd dollars. Okay, I think the difference is about ten bucks difference. Pretty good. Now, what did we gain? What did we lose? With the MSI, I gained a better display, ten eighty p as well, super clear, anti glare. I have to say, wow! Right out of the box, right off the bat, I didn't have to do anything to it. Look how clear and crisp it is. I really, really, really like this display. MS, uh, Lenovo, on the other hand, um, out of the box, I had to play with the settings. It was a little saturated, kind of looked funny. Uh, Anti-glare as well, but here, let me turn up the brightness a little bit. There we go. But um, I have to say the win goes to MSI. So let's bring down the brightness because I, like I like to conserve battery. <laughs> okay, now... The MSI has an NVIDIA 840M GT, whereas the Lenovo has the GTX 860M. Both are two gig cards. Okay, I just want to make a quick little thing here. I do not have games installed on this laptop yet. The only game I have is Dark Souls 2. Okay, 
So I can't really compare that because, to be honest, Dark Souls 2 is a pretty easy game to run anyways. It does run on this computer on max settings. Resolution at 1600 by 900, okay? To get it full 60 frames. If I go 1080p, I drop about 30 frames, okay? If you don't mind dropping down the 30 frames, it can run at 1080p. Whereas my Lenovo runs the game max settings at 1080p, 60 frames a second, smooth all the way. Okay, both come with, I don't know if you can see here, right here. Oh, damn son, curse you son! Here we go, webcam, webcam, okay. Very sleek design here, I really enjoy the MSI. It does weigh a little bit more because of the extra stuff that it does come with, like the VGA and the, and the um, CD writer, okay. Um, the Lenovo, it doesn't weigh that much because it doesn't have that stuff, okay? But again, you, you gain some, you lose some. I got the backlight for the Lenovo, MSI doesn't have it. You got a better screen for the MSI, Lenovo doesn't have it. You get the better video card from MSI, from Lenovo, MSI has a decent card, okay? I'm not gonna say it's terrible because, you know what? You can play games, but it's also good for homework and whatnot. So this, I would say this one is more school slash entertainment oriented this one's both school and orient and entertainment oriented but it has a better video card okay cpu this one has the i7 4720hq 2.6 okay the lenovo has the i7 4710hq okay uh let's see what else can i say about this laptop well, you know what, man? To be honest, it really how much you want to spend. Okay? I got this one on sale at Canada Computer. So if you want, I would say go now. Go pick it up. I like this laptop. I would recommend this laptop. The screen is gorgeous. I love my Lenovo. I would recommend my Lenovo. Guys, you know what? Comment below. Subscribe and like this video. Let me know if you want me to test some games out what games you want me to test out i'll test them out on the msi i'll test them out on the lenovo we'll do a comparison um what would you guys choose would you go for screen quality would you go for video do you guys even care about that let me know in the comments below me personally i love my lenovo more yes screen could be better but you know what sacrifices must be made msi i have no problem with it i like it it's very nice design, okay? I have no complaints. Here, let's take a quick look here. Maybe we can see. There's a little difference of height. Why? Because the MSI has little feet, so <laughs> that's nice. Lenovo, I wish you would have put that there. Um, one more thing I wanted to add is uh, with MSI, they have the little warranty sticker. So you cannot just upgrade unless you want to avoid your warranty. So that sucks. I called Lenovo. And I'm allowed to upgrade different things here. I am going to put 12 gigs into this system. Um, well, an extra 4 gig to make it 12 gigs. So that's nice. Um, so yeah, comment below, subscribe. Let me know what you guys what you guys think. What's your take on it? And um, you know what, guys? I would say pick either of them up. They're good. Definitely, I would pick any of these up before an Alienware. Okay, I'm not a big fan of the Alienware. Um, I might do a video on Alienware, but I'm not too sure yet. I mean, do I really want to spend the money and get picking that up? I don't know. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's really all I have to say about these two laptops. And uh, let me just turn these guys off. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, the MSI turned off quickly. <laughs> okay. Just one more thing I want to show. I love that the MSI has the emblem here. Beautiful. You got your MSI. You got your dragon emblem here. And then over you got your Lenovo. <laughs> so guys, again, I know I sound and I keep repeating myself. Subscribe. Like this video. Comment below. Let me know what video you guys want me to do next. Um, do you want comparisons on game-wise, frame-wise? Um, I will do. I will push them both. And that way you guys get a really good view of what um we're dealing with between the two um but yes you can't go wrong 
MSI right now on sale for $9.49 to be exact. Lenovo, on the Lenovo website, it is on sale for $9.88. Okay, so right now there is a big difference in price. I think this one's going to be about $20 more than this one. And uh, yeah, we're good. Take care, guys. Have fun, and I will see you again on another day.